Good morning, I'm Matt Sizemore. An outbreak of salmonella infections has been linked to certain ground beef products. JBS Tolleson Inc. of Tolleson, Arizona has recalled about 6.5 million pounds of beef products due to contamination fears. Products packaged between July 26th and September 7th are of special concern. The meat should not be eaten. Now already the CDC reports nearly five dozen people from 16 states have gotten sick with one report from Idaho. Early voting kicks off next week here in Idaho, and according to election officials, the number of early registered voters in Ada County is higher than it's been in recent years. Ada County Clerk Chris Rich says the number of early registered voters and the amount of absentee ballots sent out are almost double what they've been in the past. That really doesn't track normally with what we'd see for a gubernatorial race. It's more of a presidential race, so uh, the interest is much higher. Rich suggests plan accordingly for November 6th. Be prepared for a large voter turnout, even if you're trying to beat the rush by voting early. The Idaho Horror Film Festival is back this week, just in time for the Halloween season, showing start tomorrow at a few different locations across Boise. But tonight you can join in on some horror trivia at Space Bar Arcade or catch a showing of A Quiet Place at a pub, uh, Boise Public Library. For a full schedule to IdahoHorrorFilmFestival.com. That's the website. Time now for a check of the On Your Side forecast. Rachel Garceau is standing by with a look at what we're looking at today. Hi, Rachel. Hey there, Matt. Well, a much drier forecast in general today. That is the good news. After record-setting rain for places like Boise and Ontario, even Jerome yesterday, drier conditions prevail today, but it will still be cool. Even though we'll see a little more sunshine, it won't do much to really ramp up our temperatures at all. Starting off a little bit chilly this morning down into the 30s. So that means 40s by mid morning, a high of just 55 expected in Boise today. Now we may see a lingering snow or rain shower up in the higher elevations, but again, the lower valleys will stay dry today. That brisk breeze may pop up from time to time, so be ready for that as you're out and about. Wind chill might be a little bit of an issue today. Now tomorrow, more sunshine, and in fact, for the long term after this, sunshine really does prevail. But so do cooler than average temperatures. It looks like Friday may be one of the mildest days of the extended period. And even then, we'll see a high of just 61 degrees, still below average for this point in October. Good news is your weekend, while it will be unusually cool, is looking sunny and dry with highs of 60 for Saturday and mid-50s on Sunday. For your very latest news and weather headlines, be sure to visit 6onyourside.com.